solar system sorting uh, slide sheet that you have to do for today. So go into Google Classroom and go into your fifth grade science class. And you can see on the side where it says upcoming due Monday, 11.59 p.m. solar system. So I'm going to click on that and then I'm going to read the instructions. It says follow the instructions on the slides to complete the work. So I'm going to click here and it looks like there are instructions on the left side. So it says use the cards on the right and sort them into groups based on their characteristics. Then label each group with a title. Okay, so I see these are all the cards. It's really hard for me to see because they're really small. What I can do is I can actually just use the zoom in button and I can see, okay, so this says Halley's Comet. Um, it's a comet, the distance from the sun, the dimensions, the orbit period. And so then I'm gonna, uh, then I can change my cursor here and I can actually go and look at the other cards that we have. So I see Earth as a planet. I see the moon, which is a satellite, Miranda, which is a satellite, um, the sun is a star. Okay, so I have all these cards. If I want to zoom back out, I can just go to 50%. I can see it all really small, um, or I can zoom back in if I need to by clicking the cursor again, and then making sure I go back to my select tool. So now what I want to do is I want to split it up by different categories. So I'm going to say Earth is going to go here. Uh, Uranus is going to go here. And then based on my categories, I'm going to sort the cards. Okay. You can sort it however you want. And then once you change, once you decide on your categories, you can type something in that changes the name. Then you're going to go to the next slide. And you still want to scroll to the right and read the instructions. It says use the cards on the right and arrange them in order. Start with the sun on the left side. So we're going to go in order now. So I want the sun. So I have to find the card that says sun. I'm going to put it on the left. And then I want them in order from how far away they are from the sun. So I need to find the next closest thing that's in my cards to the sun. So I'm going to have to use my zoom in tool again. And I can see Mars, distance from the sun, uh, 2,228 million kilometers. Okay, that's too far. Uh, I know one of the closest planets is Mercury. Okay, 57 million. Yeah, okay, great. So I'm going to move Mercury, and then I can zoom out so I can see what I'm doing. I'm going to actually move Mercury right next to the sun. And then I'm going to keep going until I have all of the items arranged. Once I'm done, I'm going to go back to my work and I'm going to press turn in. So when I press turn in, that means that I, Ms. Novak, can grade it and then you can get your grade back. If you don't press turn in, I won't know that you've finished your work. 